Question 22. Um, this is similar shapes. Um, P is 6 long here uh, and 15 long here. D is 12 long here. We don't know this length but we can work it out easily. Because this value here is twice this value here, then this length must be also twice this length here. So the length of this prism Q is 30 centimeters. Now this is the bit where you've got to be careful. Although these lengths are twice as big on prism Q, this area which we need to work out the volume of this prism is not twice that. Let me show you why that's the case. Here's a small square which is 2 meters by 2 meters. It has an area of 4 meters squared. Here's the same square but I'm going to label it in centimetres instead and we all know that 2 metres and 200 centimetres are the same so therefore this is the same size square. The area of this is 200 times 200 which is, which is 40,000 centimetres squared. Now the scale factor, well there's no scale factor of enlargement because they're identical but in order to convert the units there's 100 centimetres in every metre but notice the factor here is not 100 it's actually 10,000 these lengths are twice as long in prism Q this area is going to be four times as big Hence, the area of the cross section is going to be 40 centimetres squared, and therefore the volume of prism Q is going to be 40 times 30, which is 1200 centimetres cubed.